Right, now we are back again, hopefully. Uh, my PC just crashed and uh, that just happened. I don't know why my PC is crashing all the goddamn time. It happens so much that I really want to smash this PC to the wall or anything, toss it to the trash can, anything that makes me happy. But I can't. If I do, I can't go live. Uh, Majay, if you're still here, um, I feel bad because of the uh, goals are literally surrounded. They were surrounded. All right, we are now back. We're going to launch the Total War game right now, again. And this stupid... Um, this stupid PC won't crash on me again. It did that as well on... Can this PC stop being a bitch sometimes? Oh, there we go. Welcome, I would say. Right, let's hope the PC is not gonna crash again, because this PC is, um, stupid. Continue where where it was. I obviously have to do something about my bias if I want to. Stop this. Now I just do this. It's against three units. Victory! 
let's repair this, build this. We got now 31,000 denarii, which is good for us. Now it's for you to build a wall. And you to upgrade to a better city. to make a watch on my CPU temperature here. There we go. Temperature on my CPU is 53, CPU package is 64, GPU is 45. On the temperature. Now, while in the game, CP package is on 71, so that might be the reasons of why the game is cr the PC is crashing because the CPU is overheating. It's now on 71. Okay. Temperature went down after I changed those. We don't need much of water quality though. Um I do want to have a high fill for depth. Let's see. G forty six BC. We didn't lose that much of army, thanks to the uh, good thing they had everything. But I still want another general. The CPU package is on 66 uh, Celsius. I'm losing more on the C battles than I do anything else. All thanks to the rebels. Rebels is more helping the enemy. 
There we go. Located the port. Again. Sorry, Greeks. Mother of uh, the Empire. Damn, they have about 8,000. Well, you can uh, go up to normal. Tax rate? Got completely all awarded. That's good. Mission success. Think very carefully before you reply. Why? Until next time. If you want to go to war against me, that's gonna be on your own funeral. Let us end the bloodshed. Our thanks. <laughs> they are just okay. Let's end this war. We haven't had anything against one another, so we're just doing this. We're really for one of the best units you can recruit, Oscar. Okay, they want me to take Oscar. Well, what is their tax rate though? Okay, let's see here. We want cavalry, some of those, and some of the principes, and town watch. Imperator. Imperator. While you 
I'll have to go out, conquer another Martius, and go towards Oscar as fast as possible. Popularity in this mob has now improved. Okay. The House of Julii. Our faction's boundaries stretch to the far horizons, bringing Roman rule to many. No other faction can match the size of our lands. Arminium, the games have been held. Skippy eyes actually want to go to the Corinth. love us and we have the highest threat as well with uh, the policy in the Senate Splitting the troops. Let us now talk reasonably. Why? Until next time. Why do you want reason? Now they want me to blockade the uh, port of Oscar. I captain. Yes, captain. See here. Message uh, the Senate no longer requires you to take. Okay. That's why they wanted me to blockade the port in Oscar.
There we go. Appointment in office. Oh, Massalia even. Storm. Recruitment, constructions. Uh. Oh my goodness, I can see this uh, on a long term of work. We can finally have stone walls. But none other should have stone walls before my uh, main base. Trade markets first, then we go with the blacksmith, the military, then the wall. Hello. Besieging settlement, sir. You there as well? Order. I am uh, impressed. You are nearby. So, what is your request of uh, joining the war against me? Or you didn't do anything? That impressed me even more. They actually allowed me. I am on it! <laughs> I am on it, mate. Oh boy. Largest faction, the Seleucid Empire. This faction is now the largest in the known world. Others must gaze in the wonder and of other of their might. Mm. We have to resolve this one. Victory! We do exterminate the population at this moment. It gives us a lot more cash as well. But the population will be heavily reduced. Well, we're kind of doing what they did my first time as playing the Romans as the Julii. We're taking the shores, and then we're going to take the castles in between here, and go in for Spain around this area. And I will soon go up here. And it's basically the same that the Bretons also had this area. Obviously, they didn't um, expect us to have this large of an army. Attention to your faction. The Senate knows that uh, 
that the block we requested is now in place. You have been awarded a bounty for your efforts. Sweet. Tech settlement, Norbe Marius. The Senate is pleased to know that you have taken this settlement. You have been awarded a bounty of your for your efforts. The capital war dogs. Okay. I'm just gonna dismantle them as well, at once. No need of them. Now they order me to attack that settlement as well. They're going a little bit too fast, these um, senators. Of my taste. Definitely need to destroy this large army though. Before I even can get to Lemonim. That's their um, main base. It expanded again. You expand fast. Let's have it in normal. Damn, this settlement has a huge. Can we? So to normal. It uh, amazes me that uh, this Patavim settlement is increasing faster than uh, Aritium itself. I expected, but not as well, that they would attack us. Uh, attacking them now would not benefit my results. Decrease the soldiers. Can keep 
one. Turn, we get the Roman arches. Consul of Rome. House of Julia. Our fashion's boundaries stretch to the far, horizon bringing Roman rule to many. Guys Julius? We're getting a Guys Julius. Him I want to become the faction heir and the faction ruler. Guys Julius before they got the season name. Master, without delay, can I be of service? Loud and clear. Your Honor, like this effect. That the battlements movements Okay. Uh, Roman archers, I want four units of them. Can't get any other town watches, so let's get some of them. We had to wait for. Uh. Order. Don't worry. Which be a little bit time, still. attack me on the next turn. If they don't, I might have a problem losing towards the uh, goals. Let us now talk reasonably. Let's accept Our that thanks. for a time being. 
Because I have other plans. To stop them. Medium. Before a radium. It shouldn't be that far away though. Think very carefully before you reply. No. Until next time. I will attack. But I don't feel strong enough towards me, so that I don't want to. Without delay. There you go. At once. No. Your honor. Without delay. Without delay. The Germanic tribes has a huge place. We're all the way over here. The Britons has all the way over there. And I got all the way. Here. Seems like the Gauls is having a settlement in Spain over there. And we have to stop the Brits, continue kind of battling on, and I have to stop the Gauls. And I obviously have to stop. The Spaniards get down to Africa and get the Roman Empire. And the civil war will obviously begin sooner or later. Okay. Tertius Julius, we are finally getting children. <laughs> also going to be a strong settlement next to Patavium and Arminium. Yeah. 
They have returned. They obviously won't do much of harm if uh, my uh, generals are moving around or exactly outside of the walls because that would do them bigger harm. getting a new settlement. Oh. <laughs> Putting the cat on my lap so he won't be in the way. <laughs> Finally, Oritium is expanding. Segesta is growing. And Elodium is growing. Now we're talking business. Put the army towards the ships. I was a little bit afraid, I guess. so much I want to do. Trust the goals, especially at this moment. Okay, the ships went away, that's good. I'm 
might not have the time to care take Lemonium because I was upheld. By the Gallic uh, forces. Carlis? That's just Helios. He finally got a woman. Actually, I'm waiting for um, guys Julius that got born. Spain, dear friend. Our thanks. I'm their first trade partner. And I got 80,000 now. Of denaries. My turn to make an attack. On your goal. Besieging the settlement. Seeking settlement is under siege, sir. Cavalry, And we failed the mission. Sorry, Senate, people of Rome. I declared war on someone that you asked me to go to war against. I was at war against them at the time being. But your Senate are corrupted of power Norikum Decius Curses Lost the Spy Ah, uh, fuck you, SPQR. Senator's turn against your faction and no longer regards you with favor. You have been stripped of office. Now it is the um, Scipio that is having the glorious empire of the Senate side. Blockade port Thermod again. Ready to sail. Set sail. I just say to the Senate, just you wait. I'm not gonna declare war on you, but you are the one to declare war on me. Empirical. 
Should I control this war or should I just... Hey, MJ, welcome back. My PC crashed. That's completely thing that happened. Get the result, okay. Easy win. Victory! Should I exterminate, enslave, or occupy? What do you guys think? Occupy. Alright. Repair. Build. Retrain. Right now, we're actually doing the exact same thing I did my first time at Rome, the classic Rome Total War. Attacking the shores and blocking this way. So for now, the goals has this placement and these three. As soon as I get a new built army, more modern, more stronger, we will declare war on the Brits. But first I want to finish off the Gauls, so we have a less, lesser uh, front line to defend or battle. So whilst I'm having another army to defend this area, we could have another army to attack Spain. And we will then attack the Britons towards England. Which back in the day it wasn't called England, but it was called something else. General. General. This army is still awaiting to have the new cavalry units. I still have to wait for them four more turns and they will move up towards the Brits as soon as I got up to the Brits I will use this army to reinforce this area as soon as we get another general coming of age and as soon as we get Gaius Julius I will continuously destroy the Gauls with him and so forth. Yeah, conquer all. Back in the day, Rome Total War, the classic version of the 2004, it took me three to five years to conquer the whole map. Because it took me that so long was because of all the rebels constantly rebelling on my city after city after city after city and I was so tired of them but I managed the whole map was red as Julii the conqueror That's how you change history. Think very carefully before you reply. Think carefully. Says the one that has no power in Rome. And you demand 1,230 denarii from me? Maybe after you are dead, some time after, and then some. Until next time. Yeah. <laughs> They're assembling an army. So do I. Orders. 
We have the Roman archers. That's not gonna be good. Right now we gotta build a defense over here, which I should have done to begin with. Don't watch. Oh, I forgot to watch to this area as well. I knew they were going to do that at Narbo Matias. Now we have 101,000 um, Denaris. Oh, they won't. Believe me. I already have an army on the way. This settlement to be built. The roads, the uh, farm, and the market. There we go. Even Londinium. The roads, the market, the farm, the arena. This one had way less to build. I see why. That one need to be destroyed. Uh, let's see here. Can build the arch or the that armory. Oh, this one too. The road, the farm. I wonder what goals will do in the defense. They didn't I even attack Narbo Martius at once. They want to deplete the army. How stupid can you be? If I was the goals there, I would rather retreat, live another day, a fight. But they chose to withstand a large Roman army. We have 3,000, almost 4,000 of troops, but altogether there was at least 
40,000 units at war. Or should we say 5,000 Roman armies versus 2,169 Gauls. What would you do? <laughs> General. One more turn, then we get the cavalry. Orders. We can get one more uh, principes. Principles been fixed up. Now it's for the auxilia, cavalry auxilia, instead of equites. A study two of cavalry auxilia. Just doing it simple. So we can continue downwards over here. <clears throat> yeah, this is a glorious campaign. So far it's gone my way. Well, I gotta stream the... Uh, I gotta reinstall Rome 2 Total War. Of course, I gotta mod it, but I would probably play the Rome 2 Total War mostly on the uh, modded version of the uh, Medieval Times, because it has the graphics. Um, Rome Total War, Warhammer Total War, and Warhammer 40k series, and Call of Duty sometimes, Battlefield. 2042. So yeah, it's gonna be a lot. But today, I felt like... Okay. I know I should play Warhammer as well, but Rome Total War just got into my mind, so today. We streams Rome. That started it all for me back in the day in 2004. Warms my heart. Uh, just recently, when I was streaming um, Warhammer Dawn of War, uh, Warhammer Dawn of War, um, Wolf of Beria came by, then uh, we went to just chatting, and uh, we went through workshop, we watched some of the recommendations of there, and you 
have been put into a couple of those uh, workshop uh, as recommendations for the mods. And I was also looking through the Rome Total War Medieval mod. And you was included in that mod video. I literally like that one. And I also got through the uh, video of um, Wolf of Iberia. The video of yours is there as well. So I also like that one. Um, I tried to keep up watching all the videos. Yep, the Stresha video. And uh, what more? to remember well some of the I think is on the 1212 AD mods I think you are in and the 1010 AD ambience uh, ambience question mark uh, what is ambience I don't remember in on the fly. <clears throat> it's too stressful. Let's go back to <laughs> campaign. Yeah, campaign. Well, it seems like. It is strategically good to start as Julii, if you want to start as Julii, attack the Rounded Shores and the Lemonium is a good strategic move. I tried this once before, sometime after 2004, is to directly attack directly into the Gauls. You didn't get much income, it was terrific. I had to use cheats, money cheats, to keep up, which was hard at the time. But if you're gonna be a skippy, you're having just two fortresses. So I would recommend to occupy Syracuse Cant uh, Island as fast as possible. And hurry up and take Kalalis. And take Carthage as fast as possible as well. And if you have soldiers enough, take this island and get into Spain as fast as possible. Whilst doing so, you're having an army attacking on both sides just to destroy Carthage completely. If you are a Brutii, you should take a Polonia fast as possible. But if you want to stop the Scipiais to go to war, you should take Syracuse, Libyum, continue towards the Greeks, and attack Carthage. That, as the Brutii, will make you the stronger opponent towards other Romans. Same with the Scipii towards Julii of this area. I probably will, yeah. I think I gotta do so. The Romus Rectum. Masala is expanding. We lost Vibius Julius faction here. Now we're losing generals. I don't like that. I don't like that.
go. So what kind of Total War game was the people's first Total War game ever? If I should be completely honest with you guys, my very first Total War game I ever, ever, ever played was actually a medieval Total War game before I even got my hands on Rome Total War. Because I got my hands off... Uh, Medieval Total War was a friend of mine. He literally gave the game to me. He was like, This game, you can completely annihilate and have arrows flying. You. Oh, I remember those days. And when Rome came out, holy crap. My mind was like. Back in the day, I was completely sold to Our thanks. history. Since I was four years old, I was interested into history. Since I was six years old, I was completely interested in uh, military, like being a soldier. And uh... yeah. I was completely... It's a childhood. Looks like we got a new... General nearby. Where did he appear? Colorless? No. Here? Oh. No. Here. That's Narbo Matius. No. Nice Papirius. And one day I will be empty. I'm still waiting for uh, guys Julius to come of age. Sir, Guess what? General. Our second legion is ready. Let's see, can I find the family tree here? There we go. No. Oh, there it is. Oh, come on. So, which one of them? Popea. Vibius Julius is dead. His wife is alive. No. Yeah, his wife is alive. And his guys. Oh, no way. Guys, Julius is just eight years old. And he's lost Vibius Julius, his father. You woman, you better uh, raise guys Julius correctly. Servilia, if you guys have watched Rome season, you probably know who, who Popeye is and Servilia. Because they are very much seen in um, in uh, Rome.
home season. Uh, Fastinia, Ulpia, Marciana, Honoria, Secundus Julius, Tertius Julius. So we're getting two sons, even Gaius Julius, to come of age. Manius Julius is now faction heir. Amelius Julius is faction heir. Lucius Julius is now the faction leader. And he has Decius Julius, Marcus Julius, and they got their own sons. Nice. We're gonna take over that settlement and furthermore in here. Yes. Noble master. Can I be of service? Without delay. Yes. Without delay. Out of moves. Yes. Out of moves, sir. Out of moves, sir. No more moves, sir. No more moves, sir. There's the fleet that has been um, off some time. The rebel fleet are cowards. I have a better idea. This band of fleets. Cities, though. This settlement I probably had to go to war against myself. Let's uh, have a hopes up. Egypt and Numidia is at war. Damn how they come that far. Wait, are the Spaniards? Oh, the Spaniards are going to Africa as well. Gonna declare war at once towards um, um, the Britain. I'll accept any general, Marcus Lenin, Lavinius. He'll probably gonna be our third. Empirical. March. Third Legion. That will move. Will help. Order. This guy. You gotta take this army. And we will do it this way. And this army will be 
his to take. A move. Towards this area. But I don't want to take over the complete goal yet because that's the job of guys Julius Caesar. Now we have three legions of soldiers of Rome. I want this Roman to build at least a tower over here. My big enemy uh, for now, that would be the Gauls, honestly. Because I am very careful to choosing my enemies. If I should go to the diplomacy... Oh, where did I find out again? So yeah, I want to take care of my um, strategic war, keeping as little enemies as possible as I can. And once I have defeated, annihilated the um, first enemy I started that with, I will declare war at Britain. And Spain to conquer for the north and west. Until we can go to uh, Africa and somehow get into Asia as well once we get that far. But before we get that large the civil war will break out to Rome. So I should not try to grow too fast because my allies has stone walls. So that is kind of how successful I want to be. That's why I'm sending this legionaries Can't do it, sir. towards this area. Once we have depleted the goals, then uh, we are ready to fight more fronts as possible. I rather I rather be ready for a comeback. Gaul or Iberia? Yeah. That is kind of how I want to strategic my battles. As you can see now, 
I foresaw that army would come. Order. So I wonder Onward. if this army will be coming in time. Order. It's like I almost planning ahead the AI, but the AI of the my enemy is a step ahead before I even get far with my army. But they will wait long to build their rams, siege engines and all that. It gives time to my army to assist. Which is kind of also a historical event in real time as well, like guys Julius Caesar versus the Gauls, you know? Like one river Caesar was moving, the other river the Gauls was moving that was actually following Caesar all around, wherever Caesar went, on his river. Like Hannibal, yeah. <laughs> Hannibal that went over the Alps, came behind over here somewhere. It took Tarentum, Croton. Then to Capua. I think, if I remember right, correct me if I'm wrong, that some of the cities in the bottom of the cities of Italy surrendered to Hannibal Barca. And he defeated the Romans somewhere out here in combat. Yeah, some of them did. And then, that's true. So they had a battle somewhere around here first, then Hannibal is moving towards Capua, another legions from Rome arise, so they're having a battle somewhere around this area here somewhere. That's when the uh, Romans surrounded Hannibal, but Hannibal managed to fight through that surrounding. That is also true. Once Hannibal got Capua, the next step was Rome. But in the meantime, Scipii is retaking this harbor sides, retaking Spain, moving to Africa, taking this area, and at Zama somewhere around this area, Hannibal got defeated, and Hannibal had Rome in sight. Exactly. If Carthage would send help to uh, Hannibal and not declining his request for reinforcements because he has Rome in sight, but Carthage, the leaders of Carthage are saying, no, it is your war, not ours. In the meantime, Scipio. Oh, Carthage is like, oh, hey, Hannibal, uh, you know, uh, we are under siege because there are Romans at our gates here. Uh, please, Hannibal.
Exactly. Yep. Like the Punic Wars, the f one of the first Punic Wars happened around uh, Syracuse here. True. Carthage was technology ahead of Rome at the time. They were superior towards Rome. And Carthage is way older than Rome. But because of the Carthaginians' conflict by themselves, afraid of Roman uh, might, scared them. It literally scared Carthage because they didn't want to fight uh, the Romans up front because they already lost Syracuse towards the Romans. They lost Carlales towards the Romans. The Romans wanted to own the Mediterranean Sea all by themselves. That is when Hannibal and Carthage sent no. The Mediterranean is ours. That is when Hannibal stood up. Yep, Rome wanted those lands. And after Rome the defeated Carthage, people started to fear Rome of their might. That is when Rome put their eyes towards Macedonia, defeated the Greeks or Macedonians. And after Macedonia got defeated, that is when Everyone feared Rome. Rome has become a superior emperor, empire. And at the time, Rome has trade and uh, trade markets with Egypt from Alexandria. And Rome has parts of Spain. Like down here somewhere. That's where they owned. They didn't have gold at the time. They basically having what I have now. Towards this area. That is what Scipio took back. I remember that I in Rome to uh, cinematic trailer. I don't know if you remember that they were talking about Hannibal Baca, that uh, he will attack, take back Syracuse, and take back the Mediterranean seas, and some others were theorizing that Hannibal would go and attack Massalia. But the scouts has already seen the Hannibal's army, which was the Scipio, and his father, Scipio's father and Scipio, noticed the army of Hannibal. That they're going through the Alps. That's when the Senate is like, and they're going through the Alps! Ha 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 ha! And there'll be a, the one general is like Senators That will be quite a feast for Hannibal Baca.
which it was and he's remembered even to this day bringing his army and elephants through the Alps and made Rome tremble for fear especially the senator is not a general <laughs> And it was Scipio's idea to empty Rome of soldiers and fight Carthage. Uh oh. Patalium is very danger. carefully before you reply. Until next time. Until next time. I don't like the voiceovers. I like the classic one better. Probably to reduce the uh, taxation here, maybe not. Ugh. Stone walls, mate. There we go. I know where you want to try to go. Mm -mm. Prepare for battle. Victory! Attack! This is the glory of Rome. General. They hardly have any troops there left. Rebuild everything. We already can upgrade Oscar. Ready to sail. Beautiful. Set sail. Spain is so it was Spain that destroyed the Carthage over there. Okay. Set sail. Sir. Now the girls have some issues. I got a beef to settle with them. The girls shall not pass the Alps, or march over the Alps. Conductor Redonium. They want me to blockade that port in five turns. Do they know how long it takes to go over here? Oh. My bad. <laughs> yeah, it takes weeks, months, years. At least, Lemonium saved me that timeline. Popularity gained with the masses, so we are gaining population to the people. Which is good.
Okay, so it seems like the PC is helping me to establish the happiness of the people. So they always stay happy. Look at a coward. He ran. You think you can touch the walls of Rome? Sir. You think Onward. you can get away with it? You should think again. This is Roman territory Hello man Fleet ready Aye aye captain Look at that gate please We have to do it Get the duty get the duty Mamma mia. Great forum. Population growth, public bonus. Triari, Principus Hastati. We're getting Triari. Not yet, though. First, we need to think about the uh, market. You almost gotta get the uh, Colosseum Scriptorium Public order And then Zombie need to retrain as well, dude. Greetings. Our thanks. Spain, Asia is over. We still got time. Recruits an army here too. <laughs> I'll at least I try my best though. And thank you, um, thank you, uh, Medjay. Do we having someone coming in of age soon? Because. I really want a new general. I want Gaius Julius. 
to come of age. <clears throat> Thank you for following me, Jay. Uh, why didn't that come up as an... Uh, Why didn't that come up? It did. I didn't even hear it. <laughs> god. Lucius Julius is dead. Oh god. Please. I don't understand that the SPQR is so obsessed with um Thermon That could be it, yeah. One thousand denaries. Do you need? You have two cavalries, one archer unit, principes, a lot of them. Imperator, general, general. You need two of these. Move out. Hello there. I'll recruit two more. Of Valetes, now we could attack Numantia and say fuck you to goal. can build watchtower there. Oh my god. He's attacking. Come on, bitch. I dare ya. <laughs> Bring it on. <laughs> Please be the bridge battle. This will be the um, battle I have been waiting for. Once I was 60 years old, I was watching Cleopatra, Gladiator. And so it begins! We Romans never seek war, but having come to battle, we will not leave until it is over! Today we go into battle against the Gauls, warriors both worthy and brave in equal measure. And draw strength from this fact. The enemy are so low that no ally can be found to support them. That army is one quarter of the enemy's strength. So sharpen your swords one last time. When we have killed them all, we will have made a good start. They will try to cross in force. This we cannot allow. They must fail. They have a slight advantage in numbers, but our good spirits should counter that quite handily. 
Many times I have faced these people, and still they are too stupid to learn their lesson. Today, men will die to teach them afresh that they should simply run away. We have the high ground, and every advantage is worth using to the full. The gods have surely smiled upon us. The omens are so numerous and so in our favor that I cannot describe them all and still have time for a battle today. I want to see blood. I want to bathe in their blood. I want to bathe in their blood for a week. Now, kill them all! God damn, these bitches are incredible. And he want to bathe in their blood? Oh boy. I'm glad I'm not uh, the enemy of Rome. <laughs> At the moment. But I have other plans. What I usually do is setting the arches on the side of the bridge. And I should leave the Chiarii aside because they will be coming. Those are the only two units so far that have survived since um, Flavius Julius. Town watch we should leave behind the lines because they would be destroying the morality of our units. Got the bridge battle, mate. <laughs> Wait for my order. Hastani. 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 Unit, double archer. Probably put the archers a little bit more this kind of way. Put these town watches Quickly. towards that area. No. Town watch. Not the town watch. You stay. Move. We put Run. them over there. So it begins. This is so gonna be a bloodbath. <laughs> what do you guys think? This is why we loved Rome 1 in back in the day. 
because we abused, not abused, but we went, we used the game mechanics against it on the bridge battles. They're hardly getting over to my um, principles. Oh, poor horse. They are floating. What? The dogs are swimming in the uh, water as well. This is so chaotic. <sighs> and that was the general. Sorry about the lagging, the guys. It's a huge army on both sides. It's not much of strategic, but that's kind of how things works out sometimes. And they getting another units arriving. But the glory seems to be ours though. With hardly any casualties. Unrealistically though. <laughs> Now we're pushing them back a little bit. It's our turn to push the bridge a little bit as well. Postori. For a hill. 
Where's the music? Where did the music go? Before it was Alt M or Shift M. Control M. That's the map. They removed that feature, mate. They removed the uh, feature that they could um, pause and uh, get the music back on on different battles and so forth. They removed that feature. can literally imagine how many troops these Romans have killed as well as much as uh, the Valetes and the Archers yeah yep the price of sacrifice and my Hastades is pushing over the bridge now. Hence, quote 300 Spartans. Give them nothing. Uh, give them nothing. give them nothing and something else and then take from them everything spotted Lay down you weapons, parachutes, come and get them, best quote ever, kinda miss the music though, alright I have to find out how to activate the music again, cause that was too quiet, uh, view controls, there should be a uh, music toggle somewhere. Troops meant AI visibility unit pause. Strategy menu. Camera rotate, open, toggle, toggle music, Una signed, there we got it. To edit, keybind in, from the main menu, okay, let's finish this battle and so we can toggle that music. I want the music keep on going, mate. Look 
at that. All of this was on this bridge. They've gotten far though. I gotta say. Oh boy. To be said though, um, this actually was true in history. You could find floating bodies across the rivers in ancient times. Back in the day, I thought this was fun, but today, of more understanding, this... Yeah. Hey! Antrias, welcome to stream, how are you doing? Yeah, gold soup. Especially gold soup. Through that. <laughs> Artorius. That's the correct pronoun. Artorius. Okay, the archers used up all the Archer. ammunition. Okay. Prepare. Fire well. Now Thank you for follow Artorius Welcome We also have uh, Discord if you wanted to join to the Discord We have that as well And it's called Blazing Marines we have news for Total War and Warhammer and anything that is news feeds worthy for us gamers. <laughs> Enemy army is in flight. Pursue, Pursue them. them. Drive, Drive them, from, them the from the battlefield. The gods have filled the heart of the enemy general with fear. Now he flees the field like a coward. Attack! Now it's the cavalry's turn. Newsfeed, Woody, yes, for uh, Warhammer, Total War, any Fortnite games, any, uh, yeah, kind of basically a lot of games I have had on news, news feed. I hope those will be the Woody. It's coming officially from Total War itself as well. That general is not gonna get the lie. Alright, Majay, thank you for tuning in and thank you for shouting and have a good night's sleep. I hope you sleep well. God damn, this is a bloodbath. Stop them. There we go.
Orders completed. Their casualties were high. Oh, still alive? The gods have favored you! The enemy are destroyed! Your victory is complete! Ave. That was a great battle for some of my soldiers. goal what are you gonna do now five turns yes, let's look at the thermon riding oscar They are pissed on that city. Empirical. It's obviously too early. General, empirical, sir. Have the people there. Sir. Onward. Sir. Sir. Empirical. Let's do it this way first. Recruit. Grandfather hated them too. Stinking goals. No. Leaving the army. Let us end the bloodshed. Now we want to have a peace. You know, I'm done Until with it. Until next time. I'm completely done with the, uh... City expands. Ah, city grows. Noble Martius. Alright. Even 
Oscar. Now we're talking business. Oh shit, I forgot to move my ship downwards. The Thermon. Can't, 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 can't sail there, Captain. Half blocked. How many turns do I have left? Three. We still have time. <sighs> I got my first stone wall. Can you actually believe that? Now the stone wall there first. We'll upgrade the city afterwards. How is my Julius Caesar coming of age? He's 13 years old, so he will be coming of age really soon, I hope. Because uh, his mother is the only one raising him up. Manis Julius is dead, uh, should have been. Or he... Probably got uh, adopted, guys. Julius. So uh, Pulcheria remarried to Manius Julius. Secundus Julius is almost an age. Good to know, because we have. I have planned, guys, Julius is the one to conquer Gaul. I just want that to happen. And I want just the others to take Spain. So guys, Julius' name can become in this area first. Let us under attack. Blimey. Oh, we... Fuck you. Ugh. I hate... I hate rebels. Rebels are... Ready to sail. Bitches. Set sail. I hate rebels more than I hate the goals. Back in the day when I was young, I hated the goals more than I hated the rebels. Times changed. Radium, Armenium, Segesta, everything seems to be in order. Oh no. Don't tell me it's crashed again. It didn't. Good. Secundus Julius, there you go. Soon.
soon we will have Gaius Julius as well. Where is Secundus Julius? There you are. Get over there. Well then, he will be the one to help Gaius to keep everything at order at this uh, area. While this guy is gonna conquer down here. And after Gaius Julius has conquered Gaul and a bit of Germania and Britain, we will have at the same time go to Africa. So how are we going towards the uh, current standing of states? Well, obviously. Ready to sail. So how are you guys doing? What, was, what were you first uh, Total War game? Fuck you, rebels. Don't you have anything else to do? Oh, for fuck's sake. Alright, that's it. I gotta bring him a larger force of uh, fleets. Because now they have pushed me to the limits here. These fucking rebels. I should not curse, but sometimes these rebels are pain in the ass. I was so close to get towards there, but they are saving their own enemies. Oh. It says, when did Skippy I get... Greece? Did it just not continue on um, Africa? They wanted to fight Greece instead of. Uh, so they kind of fucked up a pretty eye. <laughs> well then, seems like the Skippy is having some plans themselves. Get some more principles or studies. And uh, Villates will probably come sooner, I hope. Carolise. Get your stone wall. Next turn. And what kind of new historic Total War game are you guys hope of a new announcement? If not a Saga Total War. If it, it's going to be a Saga Total War, which would it be? And if it's going to be a, like a Total War game, like Rome 2, Attila, and this style, which historical Total War would you wish to have? Mine would be Medieval 3. Well, Senate. 
if you are so willingly to blockade the port, do it yourself. Segesta is growing as well. Awesome temple. Okay. Awesome temple of Juniper. Awesome. In the classic, it it didn't have awesome. It was just called Temple of Jupiter. Questions marks be like Oh finally uh, roads mm. Arena Oh wait Markets uh, Arena, farm, blacksmith. There you go. How about you? Okay, you're not ready yet. Oscar is soon getting another level up, which is good. So we have we'll have strong stronghold defense over here. Spanish is under my defensive protect protection, so I should not go to war against them. It's actually the first time a day ever asked me the defensive protection. But in the meantime, I can build some uh, watchtowers around the borders. So we have more of a view towards our enemies. You build a watchtower over here. Build a watchtower over here. And fall back. <laughs> now I can plan. How things is gonna work out for me. I also gonna have a tower at this area. And I want a tower somewhere around the borders here as well. So we don't get any surprise attacks coming towards us. Because that is not what we want, right? We want to be prepared and ready. So we can either send reinforcements in time. Before they completely siege your city. Or come in directly in time. So they lift the siege and retreat. That is kind of what is kind of needed to do. Blockade Port Numantia. Aye, Captain. Fuck you, rebels. Why are they always? Being around <laughs> these ports. 
Damn, these rebels are being pissing me off. You're growing. About time. Build tower. Build tower. Now we have a view over there. Build a tower over here as well. Build tower. And tower over there. General. We haven't even bought any mercenaries yet on this campaign. Besieging settlement, sir. Besieging settlement. Settlement. Let's see. Faction. Faction. Of course. Saw it coming. Because Rebels is all over the goddamn place. Fleet ready. Set sail. Fucking Rebels. Alright, so what we're gonna do first is take the roads, ship, and farming. Hang on. I see something else that I should have done before. It's this one. So we probably need to take uh, this one first. Then we take the road, ports, market. Farming, public bath, arena, and uh, the academy. Two more turns. Roger. Now it's your turn. It's good. We finally have a stone wall. Guys, Julius is in here. Where is he? Where is he? We're gonna build an army for him right away. Where is guys Julius? Where is guys Julius? Oh, is he far away? Where the fuck is he? There. 
as Decius, as Amelius. Guys, Julius, welcome aboard. You, my boy, you gonna rule the world. <laughs> but first, we gotta build an army. But at the same time, okay, what kind of uh, honor goes, carpet, ballistas, volatiles, Roman up, choose. These are Roman archers, right? Yeah. So you can get uh, three Roman archers. And uh, what are you gonna get? Incendiary pigs. Equity is it? And it was training of cavalry auxilia. So it's basically the same cavalry auxilia. So I give you two of those. to just do something differently. I really do want Caesar, Gaius, Julius faster on the Gaul attacks so he can conquer Gaul. Okay, let's remove that one, put that one last. You will give a Town Watch, Principus, uh, and Triari. So Principus is basically the same. Let us now talk reasonably. Fuck Until off. Until next time. They sensed that Gaius Julius has arrived. Fuck you rebels. Fuck you rebels. What the fuck? You done? You had to destroy my one army of fleet. Just one. Bale Tower. Okay, some of my castles should be able to have the upgrade ready somewhere. You 
are soon ready. You are working on your progress. Carlis is uh, done with his. Generals. Now we have watchtowers at our borders. I want watchtower over here as well, just to have a protect protected. Easy fight for my Romans. Victory! Exterminate. I do that. are free of this area so our next battle will actually be about the saga of Gaul with Gaius Julius The Emperor himself. For the masses. There we go, now you're ready. Now we gotta build the roads, market, port, arena. You're going full the Roman way. should have is a uh, watchtower over here as well At least now all our borders are safe. All our people are happy. So 
after he is done with recruiting this army, he will get uh, some uh, onagers for the siege battles. Because, hey, his guy's Julius. And I would call him Caesar, because his guy is Julius Caesar. The father of guys Julius Caesar, which is Caesar, guys Julius Caesar, and so on. Alliance and trade rights, Our very good ahead. We're building a good empire. And they wanted to do, do it again. Ready to sail. Yes, Captain. This time, aye, aye, Captain. this bloody uh, rebels won't do it to me again. Get over there, mate. Build me a tower. The people over there ain't happy. Should probably have one tower over there as well. Just so we have more view across the map. It won't help much, but it will give us a little bit... Nah, we ignore that. Okay. Get back to Nabumatius. Seems like the uh, Gauls are preparing for a battle as well. As much as I am preparing for uh, next uh, battle. One more turn, and we have it, mate. Now we have two stone walls. It has grown well. soon also get a stone wall nice 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 we can reduce the tax rate for this so Numantia can uh, have a little bit of growth faster for us. Talus Julius, coming of age. You'll get the Patavi Mami. Guys, Julius is having his own is being built for him now. <clears throat> I literally can't wait to have more of the glorified guys Julius Think Caesar. very carefully before you reply. You should think carefully before you threaten. Until next time. Because, you know, there is a Roman legion standing at the borders, and I have three large Roman legions 
ready to battle. And we are ongoing to build the fourth legion. Can I change the name of uh, the army here though? Can I? Roman general heavy. Uh, maybe not. Let's see if we can if they are outside of the fortress. No, can't. Sad face. One more turn for Gaius Julius, and he will have Onagers Siege Engines, which is needful for uh, sieges. Now we will build cavalry, and you build archery. You build blacksmith. You build that. Beautiful. That's exactly what I wanted to see. Just need to build one of the Onagers. We have two cavalry. Could take one more archer. I should wait for the Triari though, the Triari unit. Or do we have the Auxilia Spears? No, I don't. Not in this fortress though. Do we have it here? No, we don't. No auxilies. Six more turns. And it's probably six more turns for that one. basically the same on all of it, so let's try to do it this way instead. I think that should be the best way. Instead of waiting 12 more turns to get the Triari units, then I rather wait 6 turns to get Triari. Senate assistance. Your reward uh, unit is located at your capital, Burimi. The Senate admires your efforts. So we got three units? I don't see any free units here. Oh, we got the ships. Thank you so much. Right, we blockaded the gates of Thermon. Now the uh, British eye is moving. Damn, this Lucids. They got some power. I wonder how large the Lucids are. At this moment. Just so you guys know, this is the vanilla.
Let us end the bloodshed. No. Until next time. And know what you gotta do. You will attack. Simple as that, you will just attack. I had to babysit some times on my castles to see if there is more place to build. Five more turns. I could easily by now defeat uh, the goals, but I choose not to. Because I want Guy's Julius to do so. And I want him to probably get this Caesar name. The uh, Skippy eyes. They have undoubtedly got the Senate floor. There you go, the uh, Skippy eyes has taken uh, the Greece all by themselves. Now Brutia has taken Macedonian. Scipia has completely ignored uh, Africa by the uh, by the time and focused their forces on uh, east. Why? Right, we can probably go to war against the Britain by now because the goals are... Yeah. Uh, Marcus, Julius, Maximus... Dishes... Alright, so we have archers, we are on our way to get um, uh, Triari soon, that's five, one, two, three, four, five, so we can recruit more principes, one more archer unit, be one two three four five one two three and three triaries fair enough I can't wait to have guys Julius coming we will finally then conquer Gaul and Britain it's time I'll take him. <laughs> Nero Macrinus. I got a Nero name. 
Olivia. Three more turns. And our glory will be ours. The Roman Empire. We got you. Don't worry guys, Julius Caesar will have gold in no time. Amulius Julius is dead. That's my biggest guess, that was over there. <sighs> yeah, he died. In terms of how much improved opinion of achievements, and now look favorably, favorably upon you, mostly, most of the time. Accept him as well. Now he is in uh, the Caesar's Aritium. Tiberius. We can uh, play a little bit of roleplay about that. Tiberius is closest friend now to you guys, Julius. Macedon is destroyed. Blimey. Seems like Brutii finally got the last settlement of Macedonia. But if I get too powerful enough, I could be able to destroy and go to civil war. And I'm probably going to do it if um, the Romans is not going to destroy me or attack me in the first place. The Seleucid Empire is still large. largest Seleucid Empire. It's actually the first time I've ever seen that the Seleucids have survived this far in the campaign. It's time. We get attack. Written. I had enough of them. 
I'll do that before the uh, <laughs> uh, bridge eyes changing their mind to get further up. Where's the battery going on for this headset? Let yeah, it's not okay. talk reasonably. Until Why? next time. Th this is the time you should ally yourself with Britain because Britain is war with me. You know. Something? Because I have Think Germany. Very carefully before you reply. Until next time. Go ahead. Attack me. Where is your threat? <laughs> Greetings. Trace. Oh, thanks. Wants trading. Okay. What? No. Located port Londinium. Fleet ready. There we go. That settlement isn't hard to overtake anyway. Victory! Okay. It seems like they had some issues to... Destroy that because we are Romans. Leave region. Your flagrant disregard for Senate policy is disturbing and dangerous. Rome relies on the great families to support its policies. If each family makes their own foreign policy, there will be chaos. Where is Norikum? in Norikim anyway. City expands, Narbo Martius. Admiral Marcus, okay. Path blocked. He got through it, so it's alright. Uh Stone walls. Mm -hmm. 
guys, Julius Caesar might. You, my friend. You will have the mightiest Roman army so far. And you will rule the world. soon have a bunch of stone walls. We have three. The Brudia has one, two, three, four. The Scipia has one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, eleven stone walls. That's all their cities. Lucky bastards. Faction boundary stretch. Our guy, guys, Julius Caesar, he wasn't born until late 100 BC somewhere but we are now in the Gaius Julius family Fact here earning quite a lot by low tax rating. I think it should be safe for you to. stupid if I did that because I shouldn't have sacked the city go he is old manius julius 60 
Uh, that's not look gooding for him. Kondite Redunum Spaniards have a large army in the bottom there. My biggest fear is to go to war with them. Oregon. Okay, so this Senate wanted me to leave that area of Norigum. So that wasn't the plan of the SPQR, the Senate, to have me to conquer Norigum. Okay, so the Britons has the area there with there, and I have a couple settlements left. Okay, the Britons is fighting against Germany, Germania, because I declared war on the uh, Britons. Then I should conquer that place, Mogenaticum, and Trier Capital, and so forth. Whatever Britannia takes over, I'll take. Population, that's good. Hate rebels. They are the worst of the worst. Let's have a look in the Discord for a moment. Lucius Oh, I have three generals there now Okay General. Yeah, 39, 
have 20, we have 58. Well, I need you to be in uh, Rome settlement. Construction. Nice, nice, nice. Let's have a look. I'll stop streaming until a uh, guy has reached into goal. That is when I gotta stop. So the next title will actually be goal, a uh, Caesar in goal, basically. cat is attention just want to sleep on the lap One more turn for that one. Nice. Uh, let's see here. Uh, next turn. City ready. Is it Matavi? It was. And uh, we get a high market shipment. Arena. So forth. Gonna take that. Bunch of uh, largest faction. Jesus. Let's compare my empire with the Seleucids here. close and the skip oh my god the Bruda is slowly growing you can see my line has gone straight up how about the skip guy it just 
making that bow and just going upwards. Mine is a straight line. So Lizard has gone straight line, and it went a little slightly on the side, and it goes straight up. How about Egypt? Oh, Egypt is having a hard time. How about Parthia? Having a hard time. Pontus having a hard time. Gaul is having a hard time. Germania is having a hard time. But Britannia is having a good time. Romania is gone. Dacia is gone. The Greeks, they are downhill but slightly moving upwards. And the media, they are currently at war against Scipii. So they're going downhill. Scythia, which I think is the Russians. Is going up and down. Spain is having a good time. Thrace is having a hella bad time. So the Seleucids and uh, Scipio. Scipio is way beyond me. So military ranking there is Brutii and Scipii way above me production ranking the Seleucids is really high up there the Scipii is going downhill the Brutii is going downhill and the Scipii is going way back up again, so they had some issues in the production. Mine has just going a uh, straight line, with a bow turning upwards. Territorial ranking, at least I'm above uh, the Scipii and the Brutii on that one. Financial ranking. That is where I am strongest in compare. Of any other factions. Well, I should be the richest faction, but look at S Senatus Populus Quer Romanus, SPQR. Having a hell of a good time. Because the Romans, the SPQR, the Senate, is getting all the financial trades that the Scipii, Brutii, and Julii are getting. And all that goes to them. So they are rich as hell. Because of us, oh, whoa, 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 the Vesuvio is waking up. Goodbye, Pompeii. Because Pompeii is actually around this area here near uh, Vesuvio. Caesar, you're almost ready. I can't wait. For him to actually have his first large legion that will conquer gold. Long live Caesar.
He's actually my favorite character though. Or in history. Except of Scipio, Africanus. Where's the Chia return? How old these guys been? Can't be that old. Or he probably is. Starting to get old. 24. So yeah, he will be in age when he first gonna go to war in Gaul Imperial. for his first time. Guys, almost ready. Manius, Nice, Papyrus, Marcus, Julius, Decius, Julius, City Expand, Oscar. Most advanced faction, the House of Julii. By rebels, and uh, orders, orders. this arm is yours. Yeah, this city has no availability for recruitment of. Principes. So we gotta go over here Forward. and conquer Britain. It's as much possibility we can at least. Okay, it seems like Germania has lost these two factions to Britons. So I have a lot to fight. So I should probably build my fifth legion with this guy. And move him up here with the modern Roman forces as well. We must go our separate ways. Cancel military access, nullify protector and status, cancel military access, okay. Our thanks. It seems like the Spaniards has some plan in mind. doesn't hurt me that much. I know all where all their bases are. Fleet ready. Yes, Captain. Tavim. 
the last Imperial Palace. Two more turns, Isa, and you can actually move. Oh, I forgot. I forgot about the blocking it in that port. My bad. Fleet ready. Nice. Also be like, uh, why is it taking it so long for the Romans to attack us? The alliance between these two people lies in the tatters. The course of their future relations has yet to be decided. Time now, see. I captain. I captain. Set sail, ship captain. We can still blockade though. All right, our Caesar is ready. To move his army. Gaius is on these borders. There is no one that can stop him. No one. Absolutely nobody can stop. Greetings. The Medians wants to uh, negotiate. The trade agreements? Our thing. Sure. You are at war with my allies, but you can still trade. Okay. They want 
me to blockade Redonia. Can these ass holes get out of my way? Ugh. Bounty of your efforts. Nice. You got one hundred and one thousand denaries. Pretty good. Let's just disband those fleets. There's no need over there. Let's take those fleets up. Seems like Patavium is most growing city of all. that prepare for battle besieging settlement sir besieging settlement sir Imperator. can have him Move out. build a watchtower over help. there Build a watchtower. Should have a watchtower over here though. And furthermore on the sides. So we have more views on our borders. More eyes on it at least. stop until your fleet is done for Desius Julius is now dead Imperator. good thing it wasn't him Move out. Build tower. And Move you should out. also get over there as well. city that has to suffer
Alright guys, now I have done my duty, now guys Julius is now at the borders of Golds. So that will be the next stream I gotta do, which will be called Guys Julius Ziza, or Guys Julius, at Golf. Until then guys. I'm gonna have to save this one. Julia campaign. Stream. Save succeeded. Now guys, thank you everybody for coming here. Thank you Majay. And thank you Artorius for again for the follow. Same with Majay, thank you for the follow. And if you haven't gone to the Discord channel or Discord, you can exclamation mark Discord, and uh, you will be able to join the Discord server. So, until next time, guys, I'll catch you on the next trip. Take care.